My name is Robert Clark. I'm a freelance photographer, and I'm shooting a picture of a uh, 45-foot snake for the Smithsonian Magazine. Look, I, I think like the Octobank, up as high as it can go without the diffusion on it to begin with, and then we'll just kind of build from that. What we're trying to do here is we have this nice, big, beautiful model. We're trying to light different sections of it, so we're treating it like it's a headshot of a person. So I'm just kind of trying to get the lighting just all sussed out and figure out what we're going to do with it. For me, it's about lighting something and getting people to look where I want them to look. He's got real personality. Yeah. Thank God we got this. This wasn't working this morning. Then we're going to pull it in Photoshop, Luke, after we get this and just make sure that the eye pops out enough. Okay and yeah, kind of play with it a little bit. It's pretty amazing to, to think that there was something that this enormous. So it's a, it's a good story. Sometimes when you're out shooting stuff and you only have a minute or two to do it, you just do it the best you can and figure it out. And here you have a lot of time and a lot of possibilities. I might want a diffusion on this head. Uh, it's looking pretty interesting. And now just going to try different lens choices, like longer lens and shorter lenses to throw the background out of focus more. Or, you know, this is, there's an endless variety. Yeah, you need to go uh, foot that way. Photography, in most situations, is really about what you leave out and what you choose not to include. Come look at this, it's a pretty good beginning. Thank God for digital, that we don't have to like shoot this and then wait to see the film anymore. We need to get some light on that so there's context to it. But if you look at that, that's kind of cool. I think this is too no, it, it, needs, it needs something in there too. 